My name is Ryan, and today we're going to talk about the top 10 skins they use the most. Now, let's click on all the to all the Battle Pass skins, but yeah. Coming in at number 10 is Guff, right? Man, Guff is such a good skin. I don't know where to start with this. Uh, Guff is really creative, and I absolutely love wearing him in game. Yeah. Really good skin, and I absolutely, you know, just enjoy wearing him. He has a great design, and he reminds me, and he's basically a buff Ollie, if you can say that, and it's super creative. All right. Number nine is going to go to Kit. And for this segment, I'm not even talk. I'm just gonna play the emote and think about this with the handsome in disguise. All right, three, two, one. Yeah, this is why mechs were disabled in creative for emotes. But yeah, that that yeah, that's it. Uh, number number eight. We're going moving on to number eight. All right. Number eight is Tomato Head, and Tomato Head is a skin that will always be featured on the list because he is my first ever skin. Whether you like him or not, you know, always put him on the list. Man, he drops a couple of spaces, I believe, but still, he's just a really good skin. I absolutely love wearing him. Uh, I wear him a ton, especially when I'm doing this beautiful emote. The quality right now, I like serving tomatoes, people. And Pyro Royale is here, and yeah, I like it. Ted Nang, that's why I'm also gonna put Beef Boss as an honorable mention because of Pyro Royale. Alright. Number 8. Alright. No. Number 7 is going to go to a skin that dropped dramatically. This is going to be Chunky Boy! Yay! Alright. So overall, the skin has. By the way, we're not talking about back points, right? It's, right. The back one for the skin, uh, by the way, I don't like the back one at all. The back one is horrendous for the skin. But the skin in general, in my opinion, is a really good looking skin. You got basically 10 unique edit styles. Well, not right, it's just like a base plate change. But honestly, I don't really care. I can still see the face in the game. And honestly, he's just a really good looking skin. I think it is an overall improvement of the visitor. And I already really, really like the visitor. So, of course, I'm going to like it. And of course, it's a skin nobody runs, so when this skin nobody's gonna run, I wanna wear it. And that's why number six is going to Dio. Literally nobody bought this skin, literally nobody wears it, but I wear him a ton. I wear him a ton, and he's a, overall he's such a good skin. But like Castaway Joe, he just got honorable mention, because I, I kept on almost just the at the end of the season, but Dio I could, it's the only exception because I literally cannot go a day without using Dio, right? He's just at least once or twice, right? Dio is such a good skin. I absolutely love the color palette panels. It looks better than him than Shiona. Honestly, I'm gonna bump the skin rating up to an eight. I absolutely am. I was a little too harsh on him during the reviews, right? I'm sorry for your Dio fans. I'm here with you, and I and whoever is a fan of Ancient Voyager set, really good. And honestly, they blew it away with the space skins this season. I'm just saying right now, they blew it out of the park because. Get started. Alright, number five is going to be um Astrojack. Uh yeah, top five for Astrojack. Uh what do we say about Astrojack? Um, he's a good skin. Right. A really good skin. I he dropped down a couple location space again. Overall he is a really good skin, alright. Alright, coming in at number four is Peely. And I literally cannot stop wearing this skin, right? It, it, ever since this skin came out, I go back to it at least 10 to, five, 10 to 5 times every season because I cannot stop getting the premise of how stupid the, uh, the skin idea is and how creative it is, right? It's a banana with arms and legs, with eyes and a face. Like, what more can you ask for for this tournament skin? Alright. Now, number three is actually going to go to a skin, right? It's going to go to Infinity, right? Infinity is a really good looking skin. And yeah. Oh yeah, one last one I will mention is going to Galaxy Scout. Uh, top 11 category. Yeah, she's top 11, 100%. She's number 11, but I don't all the, I actually do not, surprisingly, don't really see her use the skin too much. Surprisingly, alright. 
because it is kind of a sweat skin, not gonna lie. A lot one the one of the Galaxy Scouts do die down. I'm gonna put her on a ton. But yeah, uh, Infinity is a skin that only a casual eye can enjoy, in my opinion, right? Same thing with a lot of my skins, right? Choices. Infinity is just a ah, uh, just an outstanding skin. He has a lot of good. He just looks really good in general, right? All right, number three. I mean, number two is Internal Voyager, of course, right? What, who can I go up against to Turtle Voyager, right? Turtle Voyager is just a skin that will never be out of my top 10 on any list, right? He's just such a good skin that I literally cannot put him anywhere high, right? He has super cool looking at stuff. I still use the red and gold one, but yeah, I did actually get the green one out to the gameplay, and I absolutely really love the black and green at style. I love the black and blue, and I love the red and gold. I think my opinion, the red and gold look looking the best. Alright, coming at number one is probably a no-brainer. If you watch my channel, it's my favorite from the whole game. It is the Cyclo. Yeah. Uh, I, just because Infinity's low, is still my second, third, second favorite skin in the game. Same thing with Galaxy, that's still my third, but I don't really use it too much, but... Cyclo is a, the reason why it's number one, and he's the undefeated champion, so he got number one last time in season two, right? It's because I cannot take the skin off, right? I literally cannot go out literally a, almost a full 24 hours without not wearing the skin. It's just skin, guys. He is incredible, the skin. I absolutely love the design with him. The back point is okay, but compared to the back point, this skin looks really good on this skin. That's why I always wear the cape with him. The yeah, he's still overall such a good looking skin, and I'm going to do that for today's video because I don't want to make it too long. Thank you all for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe to you all next time. Peace out.